Tonight, former President Donald Trump is in New Jersey for a fundraiser after pleading not guilty to a federal indictment in a Miami courtroom. Mr. Trump made his first appearance in federal court today for his arraignment on dozens of felony charges related to his handling of classified documents after leaving the White House. CBS 8's Jesse Pagan is here with what happened in court and what the former president is saying now. Jesse. Yeah, Mr. Trump's private plane just landed in New Jersey and he's now heading to that fundraising event. But before all of this, not one to miss a chance to see his supporters. Trump stopped at an iconic Cuban restaurant in Miami right after leaving court. There, he again slammed the indictment, saying the country is rigged. Former president and current presidential candidate Donald Trump walked into a serenade at Miami's iconic Versailles restaurant today, where he also slammed the federal indictment. I think it's a rigged deal here. We have a rigged country. We have a country that's corrupt. Moments before, Trump pleaded not guilty in federal court to all 37 felony charges he's facing. The indictment accuses Trump of illegally retaining classified documents, storing them at his Mar-a-Lago home, and conspiring to hide them from the government after it subpoenaed him to get them back. What we are witnessing today is the blatant and unapologetic weaponization of the criminal justice system. That seems to be part of the defense from Trump's legal team, at least in the court of public opinion. Meanwhile, while announcing the indictment Friday, special counsel Jack Smith maintained the case is not politically motivated. We have one set of laws in this country, and they apply to everyone. Regardless, supporters and protesters alike lined the streets leading to the courthouse this morning. This whole country has been brainwashed. Sad day in America. As they watched the historic arrival of a former president facing federal felony charges. The court hearing was only about 45 minutes long. After that, the court released Trump on his own recognizance. He's allowed to keep his passport and has no limits on domestic or international travel, but he's not allowed to talk to his aide, Walt Nada, who is facing six counts of his own in the indictment. Marcella, Carlo. Thanks, Jesse.